Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. This is your weekly violent crime report for the city of Columbus, Ohio from the calendar week of April 16th through April 24th of 2021. First up, we have a victim, Gariella McCrary, female, age 20 and a victim, female, age 4. A suspect, Jordan Gilbert, male, age 21. Charges of two counts of felonious assault. On April 16th, 2021, Columbus police officers responded to East Livingston Avenue and Linwood Avenue on the report of a shooting. Officers located two victims, Gabriella McCrary and a 4-year-old female, suffering from gunshot wounds. Both victims were transported to local hospitals in stable condition. The investigation determined that there was an altercation with Jordan Gilbert in the 3500 block of Beulah Road. Miss McCrary, along with four individuals, including the four-year-old female, got into a vehicle and were driving away on Beulah Road at Carolyn Avenue. Mr. Gilbert followed the vehicle from the altercation and fired multiple gunshots at the vehicle, striking the victims. The vehicle fled the location and attempted to locate a hospital for the juvenile victim until they stopped and called police. Mr. Gilbert was located a short time later. Anyone with information regarding this incident is asked to call Columbus Police Felony Assault Unit or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. Next, we have a victim, Talik Chovis, male, age 24. On April 16, 2021, at approximately 7.02 p.m., Columbus Police Patrol officers were dispatched to St. Anne's Hospital on a report of a walk-in shooting victim. The victim, Talik Chovis, stated he was walking in the 1600 block of Cleveland Avenue when he passed two male blacks on foot and a black vehicle, being driven by a male white. The victim stated he heard a gunshot, so he ran and dropped to the ground. The victim looked back and realized they were shooting at him, and he dropped to the ground again. Mr. Talik explained that when he woke up, a male was going through his pockets for his car keys, placed him in his vehicle, and drove him to the hospital. The victim is listed in stable condition. This incident is still under investigation. Any, anyone with information regarding this incident is asked to call Columbus Police Fel Felony Assault Unit or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. Next, we have a victim, Doc Parker, male, age 18. April 17, 2021, at approximately 5.07 p.m., Columbus police were dispatched to a local area hospital on a walk-in gunshot victim. Upon arrival to the hospital, contact was made with Doc Parker Jr. Mr. Parker was suffering from multiple gunshot wounds. Mr. Parker explained to detectives that the time... At the time of the incident, he was the front seat passenger of a friend's vehicle. As they were driving through the area of East Livingston Avenue and Elaine Road, a dark-colored SUV pulled alongside of their vehicle and fired multiple gunshots into the vehicle, striking Mr. Parker in the upper torso. Witnesses described the suspect vehicle as a black Jeep Grand Cherokee. Mr. Parker stated that after the incident, he was transported by a friend to a local hospital where he was treated for his injuries. Mr. Parker is expected to make a full recovery from his injuries. Next, we have a victim, juvenile male, age 16. On April 17, 2021, at approximately 11.01 p.m., Columbus Police Patrol officers were dispatched to 2200 block of Kilbourne Avenue for a shooting. Upon arrival, officers discovered that an unknown suspect fired several shots from a motor vehicle into a residence. Three of the shots struck a residence on Kilbourne Avenue. One projectile struck a juvenile victim in the left rib cage. The bullet grazed the victim, causing a minor injury. The juvenile victim was treated at the scene by Clinton Township Medic 61. There were several shell casings recovered in the street and one projectile recovered from inside the residence. Surveillance camera recorded a white sedan, the front passenger side window down, with a suspect firing shots into the home. 
This is an ongoing investigation. Next, we have a victim, Alicine Kanu, male, age 38, and a victim, Dar Daria Collins, female, age 30. Victim number ones and victim number two were standing on the front porch of 1211 Arkwood Avenue during a large family gathering. A dark-colored Acura SUV pulled up in front of the house. An unknown male exited the back seat and fired several gunshots toward the house. Victim number one was struck in the abdomen and victim number two was struck in the right arm. Victims were transported to a local area hospital in stable condition. The victims are expected to survive their injuries. Next, we have a victim, juvenile name withheld, male, age 13. On April 19, 2021, at 1.52 a.m., a suspect approached the rear of 90 North Warren Avenue from the alley. The suspect fired six times into the rear of the house. The juvenile victim was in his bedroom when he struck, was struck in the lower right portion of his back. He was transported to Nationwide Children's Hospital in critical condition. There were no witnesses able to provide any additional suspect or suspect vehicle description. Anyone with information regarding this incident is asked to contact Columbus Police Felony Assault Detective Pruitt or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. Next, we have a victim, Donnell Thompson, male, age 26. On April 20, 2021, at 2.41 a.m., Mr. Donald Thomas were called 911 to report while sitting in his car outside of 964-966 North 4th Street. He heard what he thought was a gunshot and felt something hit his leg. It wasn't until after driving to a safe location that he realized the bullet had passed through his car door, injuring him. Responding officers were able to recover the projectile, which was turned in as evidence. Mr. Thompson received a minor injury to his left calf and was not transported to the hospital. Anyone with additional information on this incident is encouraged to call Columbus Police Assault Unit or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. Next, we have a juvenile female, age 16, and a suspect, Avante M.T. Sanford, male, age 20, arrested on felonious assault charges. On April 22, 2021, at approximately 2.41 p.m., Columbus Police Patrol officers responded to the area of 3053 Gladsmore Court on the report of a shooting. Upon arrival, officers located the juvenile victim suffering from a gunshot wound to her lower body. The victim was subsequently transported to a local area hospital in stable condition. It was later learned that the victim was walking home from the bus stop when she was struck by gunfire which was fired from a passing vehicle. Witnesses were able to provide a suspect vehicle description and approximately one hour later patrol officers located that suspect vehicle and detained the inv individuals within. Avante Sanford was one of the, those individuals and through the course of the investigation was positively identified as the shooting suspect. Anyone with further information regarding this incident is asked to call Columbus Police Felony Assault Unit or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. Next, we have a victim, Paul Nichols, male, age 38. On April 22, 2021, at 1014 p.m., Patrol officers responded to 2800 Briggs Road on a report that a victim showed up at his cousin's house with a single gunshot wound. Upon arrival, officers observed that the victim had a gunshot wound to his right calf. The officers were able to determine, with the assistance of a shot spotter alert, that the shooting occurred in front of 906 South Harris Avenue and were able to locate a scene. The victim stated that an unknown male black fired several gunshots at him as he was standing outside of his vehicle. The victim then ran away from the suspect and to his cousin's house for assistance. The victim was transported to Grant Hospital in stable condition and is expected to survive his injuries. Next, we have a victim, Sergio Sandoval, male, age 43. On April 23, 2021, at 3.27 a.m., Columbus Police Patrol officers were dispatched to 2815 Linview Avenue 
on the report of a shooting. Upon arrival, officers found a victim who was shot in the right forearm. The victim was transported in stable condition to Riverside Hospital by CFD Medic 16. The victim is, ex is expected to survive his injuries. Next, we have a victim, John Doe, male, unknown age. On April 18, 2021, at 1.48 a.m., patrol officers responded to the area of 25th Avenue and Medina Avenue on a shooting. Officers located an unaf unidentified black male inside a vehicle in the south alley of 25th Avenue, suffering from a gunshot wound. Medic 16 transported to Grant Hospital and was pronounced at 2.19 a.m. Anyone with information regarding this incident is asked to call Columbus Police Homicide Section or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. This is the 59th homicide in Columbus, Ohio in calendar year 2021. Detective Jones is the lead investigator on the case, being assisted by Detective Camp Donovan. Next up, we have a John Doe, male, age 59. On April 18th at approximately 8.11 a.m., patrol responded to a shooting at Sullivan Avenue and South Richardson Avenue. Upon arrival, they discovered the victim inside a vehicle suffering from gunshot wounds. The victim was transported to Grant Hospital, where he was later pronounced dead. The only suspect information we have is a silver car pulled alongside the vehicle the, vehi the victim was driving, fired shots, and sped off, according to witnesses. Anyone with information regarding this incident is asked to call Columbus Police Homicide Unit or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. This is the 60th homicide in Columbus, Ohio in calendar year 2021. Next, we have a victim, Dell Fields Jr., male, age 33. On April 20, 2021, at 3.38 a.m., patrol officers were dispatched to the rear of 293 East 15th Avenue on a shooting. Upon arrival, officers located the victim, Mr. Dell Fields Jr., suffering from apparent gunshot wounds. Mr. Fields was transported to a local hospital by CFD Medic 18, where he was treated for his injuries. Despite receiving life-saving medical treatment, Mr. Fields succumbed to his injuries and was pronounced at 5.36 a.m. At this time, the motive for this incident is still unclear. Anyone with information regarding this incident is asked to call Columbus Police Homicide Section or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. This is the 61st homicide in Columbus, Ohio in calendar year 2021. Lastly, we have a 15-year-old boy is arrested and charged with murder after shooting and killing another 15-year-old in southeast Columbus, according to police. Officers were called to the 3200 block of Marion Place just before 4 p.m. Tuesday. When officers arrived, they found 15-year-old Trayvon Dixon shot. Dixon was taken to Mount Carmel East in critical condition, where he was later pronounced dead at 4.31 p.m. Police said 15-year-old Nasir Nidier shot Dixon, and Dixon was able to return fire, hitting Nidier before collapsing at the scene. Nidier was dropped off at Nationwide Children's Hospital, where he was treated for the gunshot wound, according to police. Police said Nijay is charged with murder. Anyone with additional information about the shooting is asked to call Columbus Police Homicide Unit or Central Ohio Crime Stoppers. Dixon's death is the 62nd in the city of Columbus in 2021. This concludes your weekly violent crime report for the city of Columbus, Ohio for the week of April 16th through April 24th, 2021. Be safe out there.